Ah, what a splendid day to work in Google Cloud's model garden. Observe the Google Foundation models flourishing alongside these open source seedlings. I say, little rabbit, uh, can you say multimodal models? Yeah, I'm not going to say that. Now, there are lots of models to choose from, so take your time and... Oh, you've got one. Very well. Once we've got our model, we can integrate it into our applications directly from Vertex AI via managed API endpoints. <laughs> Quite tidy, isn't it? Uh, on second thought, perhaps we'd better do a spot of tuning in Generative AI Studio. Let's see, what can we do in here? We can use a chat-like interface to design prompts that guide the behavior of our foundation model. Zero shot prompt. That's the idea. We can also adjust the temperature of the model to improve accuracy or heighten creativity. And then there's prompt tuning. You can upload your own data to enrich the model's context. For example, if you feed it your blog posts and tweets, the resulting AI will speak in your company's brand voice. This cheeseburger leverages transformative innovation in strategic industry verticals. But, as they say, garbage in, garbage out. For highly specialized domains like legal or medical applications, you may want to fine-tune your pre-trained model using Vertex AI training, changing the weights of the generative model itself. But Google Cloud never exposes your changes to the model outside your protected tenant. <laughs> Sorry, chaps. However you grow your models, what matters most is what you do with them next. Perhaps you'll juice the world of mortgage underwriting, or bake a brilliant customer support app. What do you say, Rabbit? To be honest, at this point, I'm kind of getting lost in the metaphor. That looks good, though. Mm-hmm. Vertex AI now includes Model Garden and Generative AI Studio. See what you can grow at Google Cloud next. <laughs>